ಓಂ ನಮೋ ಭಗವತಿ ಶ್ರೀರಾಮಕೃಷ್ಣ ಯ ಲಿಟರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ವಿವೇಕ್ ಆನ್ ರೈಸ್ ಅ ವೇಕ್ ಆನ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಐ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಟೆಲ್ ಯು ದಿಸ್ ದಟ್ ಹೂ ಎವರ್ ರೀಡ್ಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಲೆಟರ್ ವಿಲ್ ಇನ್ ಬೈ ಮೈ ಸ್ಪಿರಿಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಫೇತ್ ಆನ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ವಿವೇಕಾನಂದ ಲೆಟರ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಟು ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಅಭೇದಾನಂದ ಜಿ ಕಾಲಿ ಮಹಾರಾಜ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಯುನೈಟೆಡ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಮೇರಿಕಾ ಏಯ್ಟೀನ್ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ನೈಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಡಿಯರ್ ಕಾಲಿ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಆಲ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಐ ಕಮ್ ಟು ನೋ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಯುವರ್ ಲೆಟರ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ನೋ ನ್ಯೂಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಟೆಲಿಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಇನ್ ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಅಪಿಯರ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಮಂತ್ ಸಿನ್ಸ್ ಐ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಚಿಕಾಗೋ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬೀನ್ ಎಟ್ ಫ್ರೀ ಟು ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಸೊ ಐ ಕುಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಕೀಪ್ ಮೈ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ವೆಲ್ ಪೋಸ್ಟೆಡ್ you have taken great pains indeed and for this how can i thank you adequately you have all evinced a wonderful capacity for work footnote refers to the successful public meeting convened at the town hall calcutta under the chairmanship of raja pyari mohan mukherjee for appreciating swami ji and counteracting the missionary propaganda against him and how can shri ramakrishna's words prove false you have got wonderful spirit in you about shashi sanyal as already written nothing remains undetected through the grace of shri ramakrishna but let him found a sect or whatever he will what harm shiva vah santu panthanah may the blessings may blessings attend your path secondly i could not catch the drift of your letter i shall collect my own funds to build a monastery for ourselves and if people criticize me for it i see nothing in this to affect us either way you have your minds pitched high and steady it will do you no harm may you have exceeding love for one another among yourselves and it would be enough to have an attitude of indifference towards public criticisms kali krishna babu has deep love for the cause and is a great man please convey my special love to him so long as there is no feeling of disunion amongst you through the grace of the lord i assure you there is no danger for you rane vane parvata mastake va beat in battle in the forest or on the top of mountains shreyansi bahu vignani shreyansi bahu vignani all noble undertakings are fraught with obstacles it is quite in the nature of things keep up the deepest mental poise take not even the slightest notice of what puri creatures may be saying against you indifference 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 i have already written to shishi ramakrishna ananda in detail please do not send newspapers and tracts any more take the husking hammer to heaven and there it will do its husking as the bengali saying goes the same trudging about here as it was in india only with the carrying of others load sided how can i procure customers for people's books in this land i am only one amongst the many here and nothing more whatever the papers and things of that sort in this country write about me i make an offering of to the fire god you also do the same that is the proper course a bit of public demonstration was necessary for guru maharaj's work shri ram krishna's work it is done and so far so good now you must on no account pay any heed to what the rabble may be prattling about us whether i make my pile or do whatever else i am reported to shall the opinions of the riffraff stand in the way of his work lord's work my dear brother you are at a boy while i am growing gray what regard i have for the pronouncements and opinions of such people you should guess from this so long as you gird up your loins and rally behind me there is no fear even if the whole world combine against us 
This much I understand that I shall have to take up a very lofty attitude. I should not, I think, write to anyone except to you. By the by, where is Gunanidhi? Try to find him out and bring him to the mutt with all kindness. He is a very sincere man and highly learned. You must try your best to secure two plots of land. Let people say what they will. Let anyone write anything for or against me in the papers. You shouldn't take the slightest notice. And my dear brother, I beseech you repeatedly not to send me any more newspapers by the basket full. How can you talk of rest now? We shall have rest a while only when we give up this body. Just do one skit up the celebrations, brother, in that spirit, so that all the country around may burn with enthusiasm. Bravo, capital indeed. The whole band of scoffers will be swept away. The whole band of scoffers will be swept away by the tidal wave of love. Your elephants, fossil, what do you fear from an ant bite? The address, footnote, the address presented by the public in the town hall of Calcutta. You sent reached me long ago and the reply to it has also been dispatched to Pyari Babu. Bear in mind, the eyes are two in number and so the ears, but the mouth is but one. Indifference, indifference, indifference. Nahi kalyanakrit kaschit, durgatim tata gachati. The doer of good deeds never comes to grief, my dear, or uh, to fear. And whom are we going to fear, brother? Here the missionaries and their ilk have hauled themselves into silence, and the whole world will but do likewise. Nindantu niti nipuna yadiva stuvantu lakshmihi samavishatu gachatu va yatheshtam adyeva va maranamastu shatantare va nyayad pataha pravichalanti padam nadhiraha whether people skilled in policy praise or blame whether the goddess of fortune favors or goes away whether death befalls today or or after hundreds of years persons of steady mind never swerve from the path of righteousness bhartrihari niti shataka you need not even mix with the humdrum people nor beg of them either the lord is supplying everything and will do so in future what fear my brother all great undertakings are achieved through mighty obstacles he veer kuru paurusham atmanah another version is there he veer smara paurusham atmanah upekshitavyah janah sukripanah kama kanchan vashagah you valiant one put forth your manly efforts wretched people under the grip of lust and gold deserve to be looked upon with indifference now i have got a firm footing in this country and therefore need no assistance but my one prayer to you all is that you should apply to the service of the lord that active impulse of manliness which your eagerness to help me through brotherly love has brought out in you do not open out your mind unless you feel it will be positively beneficial use agreeable and wholesome language towards even the greatest enemy the desire for fame for riches for enjoyment is quite natural to every mortal dear brother and if that agrees well with serving both ways that is serving both god and mammon why all men would exhibit great zeal it is only the great saint who can work making a mountain of an atom of virtue in others and cherishing no desire but that of the good of the world paraguna paramanun parvati kritya apicha 
त्रिभुवनम उपकार श्रेणी प्रीणयंत एक्सेट्रा वैड भर्तृहरि नीति शतक देफोर लेट डल देफोर लेट डल हूज इंटलेक्ट इज स्टीप्ड इन इग्नोरेन्स एंड हू लुक अपॉन द नॉन सेल्फ एज ऑल इन ऑल प्ले आउट देर बॉयश प्रैंक्स प्ले आउट देर बॉयश प्रैंक्स दे विल ऑफ देम सेल्स लीव ऑफ द मोमेंट दे फाइंड इट टू हॉट Let them try to spit upon the moon; it will but recoil upon themselves. Shubham bhava bhava tu te sham. God speed to them if they have got anything substantial in them. Who can bar their success? But if it be only empty swagger due to jealousy, then all will be in vain. Har Mohan has sent rosaries. All right. but you should know that religion of the type that obtains in our country does not go here you must suit it to the taste of the people if you ask them to become hindus they will all give you a wide berth and hate you as we do the christian missionaries they like some of the ideas of the hindu scriptures that's all nothing more than that you should know the men most of them do not trouble about religion and all that the women are a little interested that is all but no large doses of it a few thousands of people have faith in the advaita doctrine but they will give you the go by if you talk obscure mannerisms about sacred writings caste of women everything proceeds slowly by degrees patience purity perseverance yours etc vivekananda om shanti 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 hari om tat sat shri ram krishna arpanam